What is up my ZMB Horde? So, uh, unfortunately, this is the second time I've restarted this video. I had, like, one that was three minutes in, just a second ago, then I accidentally hit the sleep button on my phone when I was taking my hoodie off, and I don't feel like trying to splice the two together. So I'm just going to take the long way home, because I'm already halfway to the post office. Actually, more than halfway. But, uh, yeah. That's annoying. <laughs> so, uh, to kind of recap what happened. Uh, 18 days until I go to college. So, that's fun. Waiting on a letter from the college telling me how much I'm getting in financial aid and if they don't have it in by today I'm going to call them because I need to know if I need to take out loans or if I need to pay something out of pocket and how much I have allotted for books because that's gonna be what really kills me is books because they're freaking expensive. But you can find digital ones or used ones and they're less expensive. So, yeah. I'm going to steer clear of this motorcycle because I don't want to get murdered. So I'm just gonna, gonna kind of go like this. Alright, be right back. Alright, I'm back. Still no letter, so it looks like I'm calling them when I get home. Kind of annoyed by that, but whatever. Because I don't have time to sit around and wait for a freaking letter. Because I said that they were going to rush everything, but they rushed it up until I applied for student housing. And so now everything's going at a snail's pace because I have to wait for a letter. But I'm not waiting because I need to know yesterday. <laughs> but it was a Sunday, so it's fine. I figured it would be in today. Since it's not in today, I'm hoping it'll be in tomorrow, but I'm still going to call them today. Because I can't just wait and then not know what I need until I get there. So, yeah, calling them is probably the best thing to do. Uh, see what they say. Don't really know who to call, though. <laughs> but anyway, I am definitely excited for college. It's just the, uh, days leading up to it. Because within these 18 days, I have... My cousin, oh no, wait, you know, I'm going to go in chronological order. Have a doctor's appointment. Have my cousin and I's birthday. Have therapy. Blood work. Family reunion. Uh, and then in between there I also have support group at least once. So, and then that next weekend after the family reunion, that next Friday is move-in day. So I've got a lot of stuff going on, not a lot of time to prepare really anything, but I have been packing. I think I'm almost done. I just gotta get more clothes and then some other stuff that I'm packing the morning that we leave because it's stuff that I use every day. So like my laptop, my phone charger, my Kindle. Laptop charger, laptop case, like all of that stuff. 
my pill that I take every morning for my thyroid so I don't die. Like all of that stuff. I'm still trying to find bedding stuff, but I think I can get that sometime this week. And I also want to get a small plant. And then I... Oh, and laundry detergent. Well, soap. <laughs> because those are all things I need. But I don't have to pay to do laundry, which is awesome. It's free there. So, that's cool. <laughs> yeah. Hopefully they found me a room, because I applied. It should have went through. And yeah, actually, on the 15th, the day that I have therapy, I can call them and ask for some help if stuff, if I still don't know how much I'm going to owe or anything. So, yeah. That's good. But it does look like I'm going to have to call them my oh, today because this is stuff I need to know. And like, my friend Colin, he's going to the same college. He's staying in the dorms. He already knows, well, he already knows who he's being roomed with and what room he's in. And I asked him how many, like, days after he sent in the application did he find out, and he couldn't remember. <laughs> so, I'm like, great. I don't know if I'm just being paranoid because I only have 18 days, or I don't know if I have a legitimate worry. But whatever. Once I get there, though, I'll be much better. Once I get everything sorted out, everything will be fine. Oh, it's one of the twins. So there are these kittens around the neighborhood, and there are two boys. And so I named them after the Dolan twins. So we have Ethan and Grayson. But yeah, anyway, that's all the time I have for this video. So remember to like, comment, subscribe. And if you subscribe, make sure to hit that bell icon so you'll be notified whenever I post a new video. Oh, and don't forget, my P.O. box is in the About section on my channel. So, if you want to send me something, go right ahead. And, uh, yeah. Bye.